Yeni News 18 Exclusive News Break. Now amid crisis in Pakistan, top sources in Islamabad's foreign office have claimed that Saudi Arabia has cancelled Prime Minister Shahbaz Sharif's visit to Kingdom of Saudi Arabia due to the prevailing political situation in Pakistan in the context of confrontation between the government and the Supreme Court. The Prime Minister was supposed to leave for Jeddah on the night of the 27th of Ramzan. In Saudi Arabia, Prime Minister Shahbaz Sharif was scheduled to meet his elder brother and former Prime Minister Nawaz Sharif. But uh, the visit has now been cancelled by the Saudi Arabia authorities. CNN News 18's Abhishek Jha is joining us to give us more details on this. Abhishek, can you tell us uh, about why was uh, uh, the visit of Shahbaz Sharif cancelled by Saudi Arabia? So far, uh, there has not been any official explanation, uh, Anjali, for this cancellation of visit in the last um, minute. Uh, which was going to happen uh, somewhere around next week. Uh, but we know that uh, Saudi Arabia has been a close ally to Pakistan. In fact, uh, during this economic issues, economic problem that Pakistan is generally dealing with, Saudi Arabia has been of great help and it has given Pakistan some a few billion dollars as well. Uh, and uh, despite the fact that there has been this close coordination and relationship, a sudden cancellation of Prime Minister Shabash visit tells a lot about the bilateral relationship that is not probably going on the right trajectory. Also, Shabazz Sharif was supposed to going to meet his brother Nawaz Sharif also in Jeddah, uh, but that also now looks uh, uh, an impossibility. Uh, most likely, uh, the incumbent Prime Minister Shabazz Sharif will be traveling to UK uh, next month for the coronation uh, ceremony of King Charles, and during that visit only, uh, he is expected to meet his brother Nawaz Sharif also. Also, Abhishek, what m message does this uh, send out that uh, Saudi Arabia has cancelled Pakistan Prime Minister Shahbaz Sharif's visit? So, it, it has both uh, political uh, repercussions in the domestic politics of Pakistan and uh, that uh, the now opposition parties can make it an issue that uh, during the tenure of Shahbaz Sharif, the relationship with its close allies and traditional partners have deteriorated. And now, uh, now a partner like Saudi Arabia, which has always stood by Pakistan is not allowing the Prime Minister to have a formal visit, especially when it was already scheduled. Uh, so this is going to be a political issue, like why did uh, the relationship between the two sides has gone down so uh, uh, so on the southward. Uh, also, internationally, uh, talking about Pakistan's own economic mess, uh, clearly when Pakistan Prime Minister Shabash Sharif is traveling to any other country, uh, his first priority has been to ask for more, more assistance and more money, more budgetary support from uh, different countries and partners, uh, and that also looks uh, a, 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 a bleak possibility now because he is not traveling to that country. So, uh, how to arrange more dollars and millions of uh, rupees from abroad is one of the key priorities of Pakistani government right now, and that is now uh, again taking a hit as Prime Minister Shahbaz Sharif's visit to Saudi Arabia uh, looks like uh, has been cancelled. All right, Abhishek, thank you for giving us that context. Slipping into a very